Teachers. APE has been called by many names by classroom teachers. We found out some teachers refer to us as the APE Black Mafia. Call us whatever you like, but know this. APE will legally destroy any administrator who tries to abuse its members. Join today and then let your administrator know APE is coming and hell is coming with us. Why? Because APE knows how to protect your career and certification. Call us at 770-347-8797 or go to myapenow.com and get the peace of mind you deserve. Oh, and I almost forgot, our office is located in downtown Midtown at 1170 Peachtree Street, Suite 1200, Atlanta, Georgia, 30309. Now, back to Caesar. The Caesar Morning Show warns teachers of principal clowns in America. To find out if your principal is a principal clown of America, go to myapenow.com. That's myapenow.com. Or call us at 770-347-8797. If you are a member who would like to add your principal to the clown list, email us at aggressiveprotection at yahoo.com. Now, let's talk about these clowns with Caesar. Hey, did you know APE represents only teachers and not administrators? We believe representing teachers and administrators together is a conflict and just plain crazy. Teachers, you will never have to worry about who APE represents when APE shows up at your school. Newsflash, if you are part of an organization that allows principal clowns quit today and join the most powerful and aggressive teachers union of the South. APE, call us today at 770-347-8797 or go to myapenow.com or email us at aggressiveprotection at yahoo.com. Oh yeah, Caesar is home. need to come on here and, let, and talk to the members and let them know what's going on uh, at the Association of Professional Educators, better known as APE. I say, you know, I always say we are the most powerful and the most aggressive teachers union uh, on, in Georgia. I can't really say on the planet because I like to say on the planet, but in Georgia. We're not in California yet. We're not in Alabama yet. Uh, we're not in South Carolina. A lot of states that we're we just haven't gotten to yet, but we are on the way. We're moving and we are growing fast. And so I am excited about what's going on uh, at the uh, APE organization. Hey, we're not going to uh, waste a half of your status, but I just wanted to bring you an update and let you know what's going on out there and with these crazy principal clowns. You know, these clowns are something else. These principal clowns, and you know I talk about these clowns all the time because it's not a day go by these clowns is not trying to find ways to strip away more rights uh, of, of teachers, teachers' rights. And they just don't stop. Uh, just the other day, uh, we had a, 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 a principal that tried to blackball the teacher by getting on the telephone. She was trying to get her another job. And, and these are this, this, these, these crazy charter schools. And uh, she was trying to get another job somewhere else. And the principal got on the phone. Well, we, you know, we don't have any evidence that the principal got on, uh, got on the phone and and trashed the teacher. But most of the time, that's what they do. They get on the telephone, they trash the teacher because that's where they can trash the teacher. They ain't gonna, they won't put it in writing. They're not stupid enough to put it in writing, but they will try to trash the teacher by getting on the telephone. It's like a code of honor. They principal to principal. They get on the phone and they ask about the teacher that is coming or how. Uh, was she a, what, was she uh, a good teacher? Uh, what what type of problems you may have had with her or may not have had? But uh, that's what these clowns do. They get on and they support each other. Uh, so I, I want you to be um, if you're in these charter schools, especially especially the teachers are in charter schools. You need to know your rights because because just because you're in a charter school doesn't mean you don't have rights. You have rights as well. Uh, so, uh, just like they can let you go without notice, guess what? You can leave without notice. Okay. <laughs> it's, it's amazing. It always amazed me how these, 
these schools try to become charter schools and try to change teachers' rights and just try to gut it. Well, I always say they gut their rights. And you need to know uh, when these are clowns are on the attack. And you have superintendent clowns as well. Well, guess what? Superintendent Christoffel, she on the way out. Uh, we wrote so many letters and protests and fought so hard. And, and let me tell you, she's on the way out. She's trying to hang in there, but she's on the way out. And, uh, she, you know, she's trying to stay afloat. You know, and, 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 you know, and they've been sending me all these letters. You know, we don't represent superintendents. They don't represent superintendents. <laughs> we just don't represent superintendents. And, uh, you know, you can contact us to try to fight. Uh, you know, it's amazing to me how these superintendents, you know, try to give Ape a hard time, try to shut Ape down from representing teachers. But when they get in trouble, they come to Ape. They try to find their way to Ape and ask Ape for support. And by sending Ape email, emails and <laughs> I'm calling them out. <laughs> he's superintendent something else and uh don't get me wrong you have some good superintendents out there i'm not talking about all the superintendents you do have some good superintendents out there i just don't know one off, off the top of my head we have some superintendents right you know that is going to will make great superintendents uh some in clayton county and some in douglas county and uh people that i know personally will make great superintendents and uh so you know we have some great people out there and and it's amazing it's just amazing to me that they don't go to these people to ask them uh, about being superintendent. These are people that have been in the school system for years. Been in the school system for years and they go outside. Their board members already, always got to go outside and try to hire a superintendent. And then they come in and bring these people in that, that simply they're just a mess. They're just a mess. They don't know the staff. They don't know nothing about the school system. They don't give a rat's butt about uh, uh, firing people because they don't have a stakeholder in the community, you see. And so these folks come in here and they become superintendents and they and they think they're going to change the world. And board members think they're going to find them a national superintendent, a national. You know, national. They are a mess. <laughs> Just national. <laughs> well, you got a natural superintendent ready in the backyard. All you got to do is just talk to them and, and get them the job. You, you know, give people the superintendent position that care about the community. You know, and I, I, and I got, you know, uh, some some good people, good friend of mine, Clayton County, great, great superintendent, you know what I'm saying, but I ain't going to call him out. Uh, I'm not going to call him out because I'm not going to throw him under the bridge, but he know who, who he is. Uh, you know, had an opportunity to talk to him on the other day. And one thing about my good friend, these, my good friend in Clayton County, he's he not afraid to shoot the ball. You got to have people in place not afraid to shoot the ball. He's just not afraid to shoot the ball. You know, you don't want people to get scared every time you got to deal with an issue and they're scared to talk to you and all that stuff and scared somebody may see them communicating with you. My good friend ain't afraid of none of that. He don't care who see him talking to Caesar. He's a very aggressive and he should be superintendent. And I tell you, if I had my way, he would be the superintendent of Clayton County. I had opportunity uh, uh, to speak with him. And I uh, always... Uh, 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 always trying to get the job done, handle, do the right thing, and and he always fair and trying to make sure that you know the ape teachers and the teachers of Clayton County uh, getting treated fairly, and that's all you can ask for is, is is someone that truly cares about the teachers of Clayton County and other school systems, not only Clayton County and in DeKalb County. I got some board members, friends in, in DeKalb County, and some board members, friends in Atlanta Public School and, and Clayton County and. Douglas County, uh, you name it, you know. Uh, I go out to eat lunch with them, good people, good people, but sometimes they get caught in the crossfires that they're afraid to do what's right, and you just cannot be afraid to do what is right. And most of the time they call me because they want me to go out there and be aggressive, help get them get rid of these crazy superintendents. Um, but, you know, you have to be willing to stand up for what's right. I'm just, you know, I was a, always a person that stood up for what was right. You have to stand up for what is right. It's just that simple, okay? I'm on a rant this uh, this afternoon, a rant. But you have to be uh, willing to stand for righteousness, stand for what is right. Sometimes it's not popular. And I and, and I had to make a lot of decisions weren't popular, but I made them. I made them because I wasn't afraid to shoot that ball, you know? So you can't be afraid to shoot that ball. You got to be like Brian Kemp up there shooting the ball up there to the state capitol. We're going, to, we're going to be protesting. I know y'all been waiting on that protest. We've been dealing with a lot of PSC complaints, uh, uh, dealing with a lot of hearings and uh, uh, grievances and 
you know, and just a lot of things been going on. But guess what? We're going to be dealing with the uh, picketing at the Capitol. Hopefully, in, we're going to send a message to the uh, student achievement uh, because they, you know, we cannot allow uh, teachers to be put on a list and where they're uh, uh, been known for cheating. We just can't have it. So we're going to deal with that. Uh, you know, we're going to finish up all the business, all the company business on next week protesting. And so uh, we just so excited what's going on at the Association Association of Professional Educators. Uh, it's just so much I have to talk about, but we're going to talk about it when I come back. Is that all right? I got to pay my own bills. Is that all right? Because, you know, here we got to pay our own bills. You know, we don't have anybody pay bills here. We had to pay our own bills. Thank you so much, my friend. I'll be right back. Teachers. APE has been called by many names by classroom teachers. We found out some teachers refer to us as the APE Black Mafia. Call us whatever you like, but know this. APE will legally destroy any administrator who tries to abuse its members. Join today and then let your administrator know APE is coming and hell is coming with us. Why? Because APE knows how to protect your career and certification. Call us at 770-347-8797 or go to myapenow.com and get the peace of mind you deserve. Oh, and I almost forgot, our office is located in downtown Midtown at 1170 Peachtree Street, Suite 1200, Atlanta, Georgia, 30309. Now, back to Caesar. Hello, teachers. My name is Steven, one of the producers here on the Caesar Morning Show. I am excited to be a part of the APE organization, an organization that aggressively fights for the right of teachers. Mr. Haynes, our president, understands just how bad Georgia teachers need aggressive representation, and this is one of the reasons he's devoted over 20 years of his life aggressively fighting for classroom educators in Georgia. If you are sick and tired of being treated unprofessionally by any Georgia school system, join our movement today. I always ask our president jokingly, we need teachers, but he always seriously replies to me, Stephen, ape doesn't need teachers, teachers need ape. Teachers, don't play with your career, join ape today. Go to myapenow.com or call us at 770-347-8797. Don't waste your money on these fake teachers unions like GAE, they have no teeth. Page Toothless, AFT, Gumless, or Educators Last. Oh, I I mean first. Join the Ape Black Panthers, the most powerful teachers union of the South. You know what? You know that, you know, the Ape is is, is, is the fastest growing teachers union in the South. And I'm excited about that because we do a lot of work, a lot of marketing, trying to get uh, warn teachers about these principal clowns in their schools. You may be at a school where you have you are dealing with these clowns, these principal. I call them principal clowns. You got assistant clowns too, uh, but they're all clowns, okay? And they get mad, they get jealous because of the fact that you you may be just smarter, way smarter than they are, and then they are. And so they get very, uh, uh, let me say, they get very, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, can't think of the word right now. They get, they, they just don't believe that you are smarter than they are. Okay? They get paranoid. That's the word I'm looking for, paranoid. They get paranoid because they're afraid that you might move up and rank and take their position. And because you drive a better car. Uh, because you may have a man, they don't have one. There's so many reasons. <laughs> I tell you, these clowns are something else. But you need to know your rights when it comes to dealing with these clowns. These clowns will try to get you in their office. And what they'll try to do is try to make you come into their office, make you sign something that you shouldn't be signing. And they'll tell you, well, it's, you, it's okay. You can sign it. And this just means that you that I, ge- I gave you the information. They trick you, see. And for you, before you know it, you're signing your name. And it becomes like a contract. I always tell teachers, do not sign anything. Okay. Or I tell them this here. Say, I'm signing, but I disagree. Okay. With the above. I'm signing, but I disagree with the above. And a rebuttal will be forthcoming. Okay. Okay. Let me say that again. These principal clowns will try to get you to sign something. Try to trick you 
and try to uh, own your teacher keys or try to uh, have you to sign something by giving you a negative evaluation and and they'll say well the only reason why you're signing it because we just this just to show that you that you received it that's how they trick you and for you know it, you thinking they're telling the truth and so you sign it and so it becomes binding you need to know do not sign anything without calling ape now if you're an ape member definitely call ape but if you're not an ape member you need to join it's just simple as that it's just that simple okay if you're not an ape member already if you don't realize that GAE Page and AFT and they all have no, they have no tooth, okay, they don't have, they, they don't have not one tooth in their mouth. You know, you need to be a part of a union that, you know, saying do not play, that that is very aggressive and that you know that's going to truly fight for your rights. You shouldn't have to be fighting for your rights. Well, it makes no sense to me when you call a union. I'm gonna get what you know. I'm gonna get to the updates. I know y'all said, "Well, Mister Hayes, you're not talking. You didn't say anything about the updates." But I just want to, you know, remind you of this mess because teachers fall into this trap all the time. They fall into these traps all the time. So you need to be aware of these types, these types of traps, and make sure that you don't get caught up in a trap like uh, like that. Okay. So you need to uh, always say, "I'm signing." But I disagree with the above, and a rebuttal will be forthcoming. Is that all right? Okay, so we know to do that. If, if you have any problem, all you have to do is call uh, our, our organization. Just call APE, and we'll jump right on whatever problem that you may have. Okay, it's important to join a union that is a very aggressive and that fight for your rights because this is the problem. Most unions will not allow you to join if you have a pre existing condition. That's why I always tell teachers to join. Because you never know when some something may happen, and some teachers say, "Mr. Hands, I'm a good teacher. I don't have I don't have any problem." But you never know when a student is going to tell a lie on you. They just go and just tell, just start telling lies. And administrator, if they're trying to get rid of you, they're going to believe the lies that the that the students are are, are speaking about, are talking about. I'm just telling you, you need to be a part of a union that is going to aggressively fight for your rights. And that's just it's just simple that. Now I started this union uh, about three years ago because I I, I knew that teachers were I, I just knew teachers were being treated like dog doo doo okay they were just being treated so bad and they needed a strong advocate that would fight for their rights a lot of people thought I was crazy didn't think it could happen didn't think I could do it uh, and they just you know just thought it was just something that I just could not could not do but we proved them to be wrong and we now have the most aggressive teachers union uh, in the South now, uh, by the name of Ape, okay, and uh, and I just it's not a day go by I don't thank the Lord for what He has brought us to this point He has brought us to, because now we are able to fight for the rights of teachers, and uh, and we do it very well, and we and we have plenty of success. I told I told you about a lot of PSC uh, cases that we have won. I told you about a lot of hearings that we have won, a lot of defect cases that we have won. Teachers, you got to be, you got to know that defects is now involved. Uh, now the school system always had a duty to notify defects, but now defects will hold a a totally different hearing on you if a kid accused you of something. That these are things that you have to know your rights. You just have to know, and if you don't know your rights, your career will be destroyed and it will be over. So I'm saying to you. The only way I know to tell you to to be a part uh, to, to protect your career is be, by you joining, being a part of aggressive teacher union like Ape. Okay, so hey, so I'm going to get to what what I what I uh, come on here to talk about. Okay, I could, I want to give you uh, our members update. Okay, update of what's going on with our organization, and it's not anything uh, secret that anybody cannot hear if they are if they're listening. They're not part of our organization. That's fine. Uh, these are updates that you know, just, just just to let you know how how aggressive that ape is moving, how fast ape is moving, how ape has come has become one of the most aggressive teachers union in the South, and uh, and how school systems are recognizing ape because if they don't recognize ape, we're gonna bring them to their knees legally, and that's what we do. Okay, if you don't know about ape, if you are an administrator out there do that that does not know that do not know about ape, then guess what? You will know. How about that? Now, I want to give you the updates that you know that we have 
the, the things that we've been doing at the organization. Okay. Uh, I want you to know, teacher, we have a new mobile app. Okay. A new mobile app. Okay. And, and, and with that, you need to go and download that mobile app. Okay. Download the new mobile app. You can go to our website at my8now.com and download our new mobile app. Okay. It is very important to download that app. Now, if you have, uh, any uh, colleagues or teacher friends, they might not, they may not, uh, may not be a member of Ape, but they can download this app. Get them to download this app. So when, uh, something happened, God forbid, they need to just join, but they'll have this app on their phone. They'll be able to look at that app and, and, and say, look, I need to be a part of this organization before I, my career is destroyed. So I'm asking all of our members, uh, to, if you would please, uh, spread the word about the new uh, uh, Ape Mobile app, and you can download it on your phone. Some of you have, have has already downloaded uh, the app, and I can see it in our back office. Uh, and some people, we have advertisement going to this app as well on Google AdWords that we can teachers can just find out all about Ape and download the app, and they can become a member through the app. That's why we designed this app, you know, f- for about two or three weeks to design this app so it could do exactly what we needed to do. And that is a, a late teachers know about where these principal clowns are located. You can get all this information from this mobile app and they can join the eight uh, organization, be part of our family and we'll take care of you uh, all in this app. So it is and we can communicate with you through this app. So it is very important, teachers uh, and mem- members, to make sure if you know any teachers that need an eight services, to make sure that they download the app. They don't have to be members to download the app. Uh, share this app with them, this brand new app, uh, with your colleagues, and and just get them to download the app. Okay, and so uh, if you can get them to download the app, we'll take we'll take it from there. Okay, we have a system. Uh, that we communicate with uh, these teachers and warn them about Principal Clown. That's why it's important to have this app. We warn these uh, because these people could be in a in a school where these Principal Clowns are located. They don't know who, uh, where these Principal Clowns are located. So they may actually be in a, a school uh, with a Principal Clown. So we so we we talk about the principal clown. We call them out on this app, and they can look at our blog on this app and see where these principal clowns are located and who all who all are principal clowns. Okay, in the state of Georgia. So the app is very important. Okay, then we have new landing pages. That's right, new landing pages that we can now capture the information of prospect teacher uh, teachers that want to be members of eight. And we have also, we have that in the Google AdWords search, uh, search engine that we pay ads for that to go around throughout the state of Georgia to find these people. And when this ad find these people, they can enter the information and we're able to contact them and get them signed up to the most powerful teachers union in the South. And so we have that going on. We just wanted to update you on all the information, all the, all the things that we have going on at our organization. We also have a new monthly newsletter that's going to be going out, members, going straight to your email. This 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 will go out monthly. You'll get this monthly, okay? And, and it's just simply uh, letting you know uh, what's going on in different school systems uh, and uh, your rights and, and, and things. It just keeps you aware of what's going on in Georgia schools, Okay. And this newsletter goes out, it's going to be going out monthly. And so if we have any members that would like to write in our articles and, and do any updates and, you know, to talk to our members, you're, you're welcome to send in your articles. All you have to do is go to Caesar at my eight now.com. Send me an email at Caesar at my eight now.com. And we will get your article published on our website. And this goes out every month to our members and so if you want to be a member all you can have to do is you can you can join the our organization at my under service uh, you click the link there and you can join and be a part of the most aggressive teachers union in the south and that's ape and i'm caesar so if you want to be a part so you can get all our newsletters 
and uh, all the new things that we uh, the uh, the uh, things that we have that's going out and uh, talking about the rights and your rights and, and your protection and, and 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 be a part of the eight black mafia. All you have to do is join uh, under at myapenow.com on a service. Okay, and you'll see that there. Okay. Also, uh, we have new uh, members. We have new marketing bro- brochures. You might have already have seen them, and we've been passing those out, putting them in school mailbox with teachers at. Uh, Superintendent Constoffin uh, gave me a letter so I can go right into uh, any Atlanta public school, okay, and uh, put these brochures in teachers' teachers teachers' boxes, okay, and uh, so we have nice slick. Uh, new brochures that we put in teachers, uh, teachers boxes, school boxes, and so they can know get more information by Abe. And it's sharp, okay. I mean, I designed that thing slick, and it's real nice. And these are all the good things that we have going on at Abe. Okay. Um, we also have the Caesar Morning Show. This show here that you're listening to right now, and I, I cannot tell you uh, how proud I am of the season morning show uh, because we have had several people to join through this show uh, just listening to this show and they have joined I've had it, it's so this thing is working out so great that we have people calling from different uh, states wanting to join uh, our organization if I allowed those people to come in uh, we, w- we would really be uh, killing it okay crushing it as far as membership but I have to turn them back because we're we're only in Georgia right now. We, we, we're discussing about going nationwide, but we got to get the law down and, and because the laws are different in different states. And so we we have we have had to uh, put those people on the back burner. But we got, you know, but we have the information. And, and when we get ready to cross over to these other states, we're going to sign them up. I had one guy was is so pumped up about our organization that he wanted to start his own uh, as an affiliate to uh, Ape in California. And uh, he's going to pay for the building, going to pay for everything. And he's just so excited because he's, he he just ha- has never heard of a, a teacher's union that's so aggressive and fight and just don't give a rat's butt about what, what they say. We don't edit anything. And how, it come out, how it comes out is just what you get, okay? I can care less. It's just what you get, okay? <laughs> because we're very aggressive, aggressive. And we don't have time to sit around and try to edit nothing. My producer always trying to want to stop and, and, and redo things. But I, don't, I tell them, don't worry about that. You know, this is me. They know who I am. They know I'm aggressive. They know how, this is the way I talk. Okay, I'm, I'm a very aggressive. I have three degrees, but I like being like a, I like being a thug. Because I realize that the school system is not afraid of a square. They're afraid of someone going to go in there and kick their butt and fight for the rights of teachers. That's what I realize. And and I and that exactly, and I've been locked up plenty of times. Hell, Google it, and uh, fighting for the rights of teachers, false accused of all types of things, all in the media and stuff. I'm not. I don't care anything about no editing. I promise you. Okay, uh, we are aggressive, and we protect teachers' rights. That's what we do, and we do it well. And if you want to be a part of this great organization, all you have to do is go to myapenow.com and join our union. You'll be glad you did. I can guarantee you that. Uh, also we have, uh, let's see, I don't want to miss anything. The ape, hold on. oh, this, the ape signs. We designed some great signs. We have those signs all through the cab right now. And, uh, and some sprinkled here and there in Clayton and a lot in Atlanta, Atlanta. We work very hard on the, um, on the weekend on Fridays when ape is closed and Saturdays, me and my son, we go out and have some of the staff go out. But I like to get my hand. I like to work. You know, I'm. You know, I just enjoy it. You know, I don't have to. I can pay somebody to do it. But I enjoy it. I enjoy it being out there. Sometimes I, I run into teachers while I'm putting out signs and get the information. You know, you, you the Bible always talking about you have to sow a seed. You have to sow a seed. So you sow. So you weep. Okay. And uh, so we we are always out there on Fridays and Saturdays. We just don't sit. On, so you need to know that our organization, we don't sit on our butt. We're not afraid to get dirty. We're not afraid to work uh, for teachers. Uh, we make it happen. And we get out there on Fridays and Saturdays and we put signs everywhere. You might see me out there putting out signs, uh, just trying to spread the word about this most powerful teachers union. 
it's no doubt in my mind that we are the most aggressive teaching you in the South. I, I don't even try to con- contemplate that. I We are. And we fight hard for the rights of teachers. And, you know, and that's just, that's what we do. Now, we might be too aggressive for some of you. We might be too aggressive. But let me tell you this. When you realize that your union not going to do anything for you, when you get ready to get a, a student lie on you and you're getting ready to get fired and you you realize that your, uh, your union is not going to do anything, then you... Teachers always run to eight. That, 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 that just goes to show you that they didn't realize that we are very aggressive, but sometimes we scare them. But when it, I always tell teachers, when it, when it comes to your livelihood, the way you support your family, you need to be a part of someone going to fight for your job. Because at the end of the, end of the day, you need to be a, a part of a union that's going to fight to protect your certification and going to fight to protect your livelihood, your, you know, how you eat and your family. And, you know, it's just that simple. And so it, this is nothing hard to, uh, to figure out. We do not allow administrators in our union. The other unions that you're part of, they allow administrators. How can they be fair? How can they be fair if they allow administrators in the union? It's, it's a no brainer. It has always been a no brainer to me and it should be to you. How can they be fair? If they allow administrators part of the union, who do you, th- what, who's, whose side are they going to take? Whose side you think they're going to take every time? They're not going to take your side. They're going to be on the side of an administrator because they want to continue to get members in that school. So it, they're, they're, they're get rid of you in a heartbeat. They're side with the principal fast. We do not allow administrators in our union at all. I have, I have a lot of administrators want to be members of eight. But we do not allow administrators to be part of our union because when we walk in the building, we know who we we coming coming to represent, and we coming to represent that teacher. And we don't have to figure out who we coming to, who we coming to represent. So that's the difference between us, and it, it is so so many things are different. <laughs> so I mean, look at our website and look at their website. Go look at their website page, GAE, whoever. Look at their website and come back and look at our website. The, our website speaks for itself. Uh, we are very aggressive and we fight for the rights of teachers. Okay. Okay. That's enough promotion. Now, um, what else have I missed? I'm sure I don't want to miss anything. So we have those signs everywhere. We have the ape store now. I'm telling you, it's so many things. We had a couple of people to buy from the ape store and it, the, the stuff that we have designed in that store is slick. And if you uh, need a coffee cup to put on your desk, if you want to buy some, some people, some teachers, something for, uh, some other teachers and you want to buy them something to put on their desk, some of your friends' birthday, teacher birthday, or uh, hell, get an administrator one. Buy him one, put on the desk. <laughs> buy the administrator one. And so when they walk in your classroom, they're looking at that, they look down at that um, coffee cup and know that, that thing hot. That's a hot coffee cup. If you touch that coffee cup, you might get burned. So they'll know that. You got some hot coffee in there. Don't throw it on them now. Don't throw it on them. You know, some of you, some of the ministry, you need to throw hot coffee on, you know, crazy principal coming there talking crazy. Throw that hot coffee on. That'll slow them down. <laughs> you put it in the ape cup. Cause that, you know, that ape cup that you can buy from the ape store. It's a granite. It's granite. It's a granite cup. It's a great cup. And it hold that hot, that hot coffee, a hot tea real well. Okay. And so, of course, I'm just kidding, but <laughs> don't do that. But, at this, well, you know, don't do it. Let ape throw the coffee on them. Okay. <laughs> Let ape throw the coffee. So, if you want to be a part of a, uh, uh, a, a, a aggressive teacher, you join ape. Now, uh, the ape store, you can buy a lot of things for your teacher friends. Uh, Christmas coming up. It's getting cold. We have the ape sweater with our logo on it. Do you know I designed that logo? I know that logo looked kind of crazy to some of you. The logo that you see on this, on this, um, on the season morning show, that blue and black, I designed that web. I designed that logo, and it is very aggressive. A lot of people say it looked a lot of it looked kind of animation, but I don't care. Is that I love it. I love that logo. Uh, and, and the other ape, I also designed that one. You know, a lot of people didn't know that uh, I can be a little artist. Okay, they didn't know I had to, had that in me, but we designed it, and it looks great. I love it. That's all that matters. Okay, uh, let's see. Um, Let's see, I'm sure I'm not missing anything. All right, uh, the Georgia Teachers Fight Back, a monthly newsletter. You, I, t- I think I talked about that a little earlier. The Georgia Teacher Fight Back monthly newsletter is going to be going out monthly. That means you can get an update on what's going on uh, uh, with eight. 
Okay, that's for teachers. That's our members now. That you only get that a newsletter if you're a member of Ape. So uh, if you want to be a part of Ape, uh, you can join uh, our, our teachers union. You can join today. For just forty dollars, forty dollars, you can join the most powerful teachers union on the planet. And I tell you, and we are growing fast. And so if you want to be a part of this great movement, hey, get on board now. Oh, I almost forgot. I can't forget this. Okay. We are working on our teacher workshop. That's right. You can bring any of your friends can come to this workshop and we, you know, if they want to sign up, we'll sign them up. Uh, just bring them to the workshop and we're going to be having uh, a, a series of these workshops, a lot of these workshops uh, throughout the state of Georgia. We're going to have some at our office. Some's going to be in uh, uh, our Fayetteville location and we are going to be joined uh, having these workshop that, talk about teachers rights okay and you need to know your rights so bring as many teachers as you can teachers you can get uh uh to come to this workshop and guess what we're gonna even feed you that's right we're gonna have a good time it's gonna be a humdinger so if you want to be uh be a part of this workshop and all the great things that we have going on in our organization you're welcome to do that hey closing arguments uh you know i'm gonna be going to law school i'm very excited about that and, uh, you know, hey, I'm going to really be tough. I'm tough now. You know what I'm saying? Closing arguments when I come, when we return. Thank you so much, my friend. Teachers. Ape has been called by many names by classroom teachers. We found out some teachers refer to us as the Ape Black Mafia. Call us whatever you like, but know this. Ape will legally destroy any administrator who tries to abuse its members. Join today. And then let your administrator know Ape is coming and hell is coming with us. Why? Because Ape knows how to protect your career and certification. Call us at 770-347-8797 or go to myapenow.com and get the peace of mind you deserve. Oh, and I almost forgot, our office is located in downtown Midtown at 1170 Peachtree Street, Suite 1200, Atlanta, Georgia, 30309. Now, back to Caesar. All right, all right, check this out. Mr. Sabby, I said I was going to give a shout out to him. He's He loves the Caesar afternoon show today see <laughs> and he loved this show and a lot of other people love this show you know and i told him i'm gonna give him a shout out today and because he's going to join the most aggressive teachers union and get all his friends to join out there in fullerton county and uh so i can't call it the school name because we have a lot of spies that listen to this show too we have a lot of spies <laughs> I feel like Donald Trump. You know, you got some spies. You know what they do to spies, don't you? You know what they used to do to spies? That's what. <laughs> I feel like Donald Trump. You know, we have a lot of spies on this show, too, now. So we got. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to find one of you spies, but we got a lot of spies on this show. So I can't tell you the school we're going to be at on next week. Uh, where we have a bunch of people going to be joining out there with Mr. Sabby out there in Fulton County school system. And I just say, we're going to be somewhere out there in the school. You'll, you, you, you'll see. You just got to see us. You got to see us. So, anyway, <laughs> so if you want to, uh, uh, you know, we're going to be out there. And I wanted to give him a shout out because uh, he's pumped up about what we're doing. And I tell you, I, I tell you, you know, I just, I'm just so thankful uh, to what is going on with this organization uh, you know, it, you know, we started this thing and uh, we didn't have a penny to our name, a penny, not even a penny. But guess what? Now, the Lord has truly ble blessed uh, April. So we are excited about what is going on this year. This is going to be this is a great year. This is already this has has already been a great year. And, uh, you know, uh, it, it has already been a great year. I'm telling you, you know, we are hitting it. We're hitting the numbers and and we're kicking towards the hundreds. We're kicking towards the hundreds, and I'm so excited. And that's this year. I'm not talking about last year. I'm talking about we are moving quickly and fast this year, and I and it's just a blessing, you know. And so teachers are seeing the 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 the, the value in being a part of the, uh, the 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 association of professional educators, better known as APE. Thank you for listening to our show. We'll be back on next week. We have a lot of things going on next week. We're gonna hopefully we'll be live from the picket line. Some some of the pickets we're gonna go live so you can listen. And the good thing about this show, if you have downloaded the app, you are listening to me right now live. 
And some of you, and a lot of you, have downloaded the app, and a lot of you always give me great, give a great reviews, and we are, we thank you. And we're going to continue to fight. And uh, you know, we are fighting all over the state of Georgia. We're just not fighting in Clayton County. We're just not fighting in the cab. We're just not fighting in Atlanta, Atlanta. Uh, we just Atlanta, Atlanta. We just not fighting in Atlanta. Uh, uh, we are fighting in Douglasville, Augusta, Georgia. Whew, I'm telling you, at the South, South Carolina line, man, we are everywhere fighting for the rights of teachers. You know what I'm saying? The Gilbert, Gilbert County. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, anybody know about Gilbert County? Ain't too many black folks up there in Gilbert now. In Gilbert, we, were, we went up there and tore that place down. We don't care nothing about no Gilbert County. You know, we went up there in Donald Trumpville. Donald Trumpville. And uh, and we just tuck on, just just take them, just take them on. We're not afraid of no administrators. And I tell you, so we're excited about what's going on. And if you want to be a part of the most aggressive teachers union in the South, you need to join the Association of Professionals, Professional Educators. Thank you so much. See you next time. Hey. hey.